just arrived at uh, Pelican Point campground. We have a small campsite. We're at campsite 25. This is our setup. We're done. We just have a small campsite. This is the beach area, but it's an unsupervised fishing, fishing, swimming. Here's the boat launch. My husband started the campfire. Picture kayo. Picture. So right now we're at Pelican Rest Marina and this is kind of their docking area where all the boats are parked. It's so beautiful and as you can see there's not a lot of people nearby. Right there. And I think on normal days you can rent some boats and canoes. Not 100% sure on that though. Hey everyone, so right now we're doing a little bike around the campground and that's E over there. I'm sorry if it's going to be a little bit shaky because we are biking. Ooh. So right over here is where the concession is at. They do sell a lot of hot and cold food. There's some fries ice cream and I believe chicken fingers and this is the campground and public washrooms over there and this is where our campground is located right in front of the playground which is really nice if you have children and very accessible to anybody and this is our campsite over here my parents so right now we're just warming up by the fire because it is getting a bit chilly this is our wood stock which you got from go rv because if you do buy your rv from them 
You do get a lifetime subscription of wood and propane. You also get this nice trail over here. It's the Starcraft Autumn Ridge. Autumn Ridge. And this is my dad just drinking his beer. Apparently beer. that beer is very hard to find right now, but you know what? For the beer, he really tried. Everybody, so we are at campsite 25 right now having some good food um, enjoying the view we would like to start off with doing some pros and cons about the campsite 25 so one of the things that I really like about this campsite is if you have children you can keep sitting down drinking your mimosas your Baileys whatever and you can still supervise your children with direct feed and another part is we are right behind from the water hose. So if you ever need to fill up your RV, you get direct access from it. Um, I would like to point out though that it does say use at your own risk, untreated water. We haven't used it yet, so we're not really sure how bad it is. However, based on the many reviews that we have read so far before coming here, water was one of the most popular one um so i'd recommend probably filling up your rv before you come here and on top of that it's also the closest campsite to the concession so if you ever need to grab coffee or food you get that direct access hey everybody so right now we're doing another bike tour of the campground I do apologize if it's a bit shaky because I am on a bike with one hand. I guess you can say this is a little bit dangerous, but for the vlog. Such a nice neighborhood. Exactly, and we made it to the highway. So right now we're just doing a little bike tour. I'll probably go right. We're gonna stay on the nice road. Do some exploring of what's nearby at the campground. We're going straight. Okay, so this is where we're staying. County Camrose. And this is some community. Oh, dumping station over here. And I guess if you need extra parking lot for when you're going down to the boat dock, you can access it right away. Okay, continuing that campground exploration. Got some kids over there. Organs. We're back to the dock area. Okay. We've kind of been here before yesterday, but I guess you can see really how small the town really is and how everything's just so accessible to anybody. Very nice. And again, even though we're already here afternoon about four o'clock, there's still nobody here. All right, and we're back here at the neighborhood area near Camp State that we're just exploring real quick here. We're gonna see how close it is to the day use area. They do separate the day use and the campsite. So I believe there's just a different beach access if you're only going to Pelican for a day. And on your route to the Deus area, you get this nice view 
of these unique houses that are just right in front of the lake. So that's kind of a nice little surprise, just seeing all these very unique homes, definitely different from what we're used to in the suburbs where everything's just very similar. So we just passed the Deus area, just exploring a bit of the neighborhood here. Seeing what else is out there. Um, we heard there's some big houses nearby that's really good for the view. And we're gonna try to find that. And wow, just look at this beach. So secluded. Nobody here. Just some seagulls, I think. And very nice houses again. Wow. And more boat docks over there as well. I believe that's mainly for the day use. Boat docks. More houses over here. Just look at how beautiful and unique these houses are. This one even has a private pool in the back. And just this nice trail that's very accessible to these homes. So that's something that you're interested in, maybe living in Pelican or buying um, a vacation home. I would definitely recommend this place. Welcome to Embleton. I think this is what they call this neighborhood over here. Got some nice houses. As I said before, very unique. There's even one here for sale if you're interested and very accessible to the lake. More of that local shot. Look at that, that one even has a lighthouse. Getting a real feel of this local neighborhood. Okay, so we're Almost at the day use area. How do you bike with no handles? So like I said before, the campsite and the day use area are separated. So you do get your own private spot. Um, this is the day use parking. And you get this nice beach to yourself if you're not going to be camping at the pelican sites it's not as nice as if you're going to go to the other side but if you're looking for something that's more secluded then i would definitely recommend heading out to this area over here okay, as you can see the day use parking is very close to the campsite area um this is more of where the boat launches are at and if you want to do more swimming it's just right over there a little two minute walk from here we're gonna be biking back from the day used area to show you guys how close it really is from the campsite if you're only gonna stay here for a day or so Apologize again if it's a bit shaky. I am on a bike. Back to the super nice houses. And I know there's one on sale here that we passed by earlier. So maybe we could check that out. An extended park over here for your children.
lindo, creo que vas a salir del sol. Mira, yo puedo estar en tu habitación. Tu contestador responde mi llamada. Give me something 